Good morning and welcome to school today. It is Friday the 18th of March, so the end of our week. We don't have a song to sing, so let's go ahead and get our day started by standing for the pledge to the flag. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Alrighty, let's see what we're having for lunch today. We are having personal pan peaches, pizzas, and deli turkey sandwiches, um, green beans and cucumbers, fresh apples and pears, and cookies. Let's see who's celebrating a birthday today on the 18th. Today is Avery Clemens' birthday, and it is also on Helena Martinuk's birthday. Over the weekend, Scarlett Bunch celebrates a birthday, and so does Bryson Adams, and so does Irene Collins. All right, a remember, reminder that on Saturday we are having, or our uh, friends at the Ukrainian Pentecostal Church are having a bake sale to um, raise funds to send to um, the folks in the Ukraine. Um, it's from 10 to 3, and um, 11 o'clock I think they're serving some lunch. Remember that our manner of the week is when you meet someone new, be sure to introduce yourself. Um, and remember that e-fair is coming next week, so be saving your um, quarters from any kind of chores that you're doing at home, because um, that's super fun and I think you'll enjoy doing that. Power Up reading ends today, um, and don't forget please to pick up after yourselves. Um, our idiom of the day is opening a can of worms, and that means a situation that will cause a lot of trouble once you start to deal with it. Trying to talk my way out of cleaning my room was like opening a can of worms, okay? So that's kind of starting something that's going to be difficult to finish. All right, congratulations to Mr. Shelton's class. He has completed his fourth red oak chart. And Ms. Gwynn's class has completed their seventh red oak chart. Okay, let's see. I've got some ready to roll models here. Sorry, guys. I'm using my podium this morning because we're having pictures in the gym, and it's throwing me off a smidge. Alrighty, Braylon West in Mr. Shelton, Miss Perkins' room. He was an active listener. Bree Murphy in Miss John's class respected ourselves, others, and our place. Um, he had, she had great hallway behavior. Gavin Osborne used his free time to do I ready. He expected to learn. Leo Santos in Miss Lee's class expected to learn and used free time to do I ready. I love to hear that, you guys. Maddie Kemp in Miss Quinn's class set a good example. She made sure to raise her hand and ask before getting out of her seat. Thank you. And Zayden Power in Miss John's class paid attention and acted in a safe manner. Great job. You guys are really on a roll with these role model things. <coughs> Excuse me. All right, so let's see. What do you call a baby dinosaur? You call it dis distinct. Maybe diaper stink. That might be what it is. Uh, what is at the bottom of the top? Your legs. And what kind of a tree does math? A geometry. And those are from Adeline, Sve Adeline Svetek. Oh, sorry, Adeline, I know I butchered that. All right, let's see, I got one more in here. It is, why don't eggs tell jokes to each other? Because they're afraid they'll crack each other up. All right, say the Red Oak expectations with me. Everybody's saying them, teachers help me out with that. Um, respect ourselves, others, and our place. Expect to learn. Do our best. Own our behavior. Always treat others the way you want to be treated and know we can. It is so important to me that you are keeping your hands and your feet to yourselves, that you are always kind here, there, and everywhere, and remember that our hallways and our bathrooms are silent places. We have picture day today, so smile pretty. Teachers, make sure your bubble form is filled out before Mr. Waters comes to um, get you. He's going to be helping with pictures today. And teachers, we do not have any primary interventionists today. That's why Mr. Mr. Um, Andrew is going to be helping me um, and so no primary groups today right now we seem okay with our fourth grade our fourth and fifth third fourth and fifth interventionists um, actually there two of them are out but I think that we have plans about those too so all right have a great day have a great weekend do your work do it well and I'll see you guys on Monday love you guys <laughs>